Hmm. What do art teachers do during their planning periods? I mean, it's not like they got to read papers or anything. They don't have to read essays. They don't have to check math homework. What do they do? Let's see. All right there, so I still have all of this left to recycle. That was a full 50 minute planning period of me kneading clay. Some of this was a little too wet. Some of it was uh, too dry. So this is sort of a sandwich of a dry slab between two wet slabs. And these other things are just too wet and that bag's too wet. But this is good stuff. And oh my God, this here and this here. So we're well on our way, and I'm nice and sweaty, and we got more to go. Update on the bowls. We're mostly fired. I got one person who's dragging their feet so much, their bowl's probably not going to be available. But otherwise, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Look at all these bowls. So many bowls. Those are separated because they're reserved. They've already been paid for. And these are the ones I know people don't want and will go on the for sale table. And this one's just so sculptural, it needs to be separated. So that's what an art teacher does during her planning period. Um, I still prefer it to reading essays and grading math homework. So we're in good shape. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Our Teacher Says What? Again, I am sorry that I um, have missed a couple of days, but I have been under the weather, still a little under the weather. So if you saw me being a mouth breather while I was kneading clay, that's why, because I'm still a little congested, but we're working on it. Empty bowls is Monday, y'all. We're getting there. It's going to happen one way or the other. Have a good day. Happy Thursday. Bye.